Walk me through how Sid is gonna help us free Matt. Um, are you really sure about this? I mean, I know he can help, but it's Matt Miller. We need all the help we can get. How do we get him? Well, I give Sid the proper cipher to connect to Matt's personal simulation, and he opens the gateway. This should be a fucking adventure. I was shocked when the boss picked you to be the vice president, but you ended up working out. That's only vaguely insulting. Look, you sound just like Julius Little. Putting a guy who betrayed you in the number two slot seems like a great way to get killed. I'm nothing like Julius. Kinsey, we're ready. I'm sending Sid the jailbreak. Any last advice? When you're inside Matt's virtual oubliette, there's a decent chance that I'll be focusing on interfacing with the intrusion countermeasures, so pay attention to the console commands. Any last advice I'll understand? Don't get killed. Gotcha. Self-proclaimed hacker god ran all the cyber terrorism for the Syndicate back in Steelport. No, he's Asha's right-hand man in MI6. I just hope we can trust him like she does. You can give me a gun any time, Kinsey. Well, you don't have superpowers either. Jesus Christ, Kinsey. Why the fuck are there words in my face? It's the command prompt. Just give me a second. This brings back memories. Damn it! The camera's screwed up. I just have to deal with it. Fucking 80s. Just throwing this out there, but uh, I don't want to be staring at the ground for the rest of my life. I'm trying, but I'm not used to the code they're using. Give me a second. Could it be as simple as 3D? Don't you dare hit enter, Kinsey! Oops. Sorry. Finger slipped. There should be three data towers controlling the security to Matt's prison. Finally, I get to just blow shit up. Well, I wouldn't want you to go outside your comfort zone. I must say, I am amused at this attempt to save a man who tried to kill you once. <laughs> three times, Zinyak. Try to keep up. All the same, what is it you hope to accomplish? Mr. Miller is beyond your help. We'll see about that. <sighs> Very well. Your futile attempts do entertain me, after all. I love meeting new people. Ooh, that's a lot of firepower. Destroying the tower should destroy the tanks with it. Miss Kensington is rather astute for a human. Yeah, well, big towers controlling security on a linear path. Not very creative for your superior intelligence. Oh, too shit. That's two. One more to go. 
know, you're still kind of on my virtual shit list, Kinsey. For what? Last time we were in cyberspace, you turned me into a sex doll. God, are you still mad about that? I said I was sorry. You gave me access to the webcam you set up in Viola's room. It's not an apology, that's you. At least give me a challenge. Last tower, then we grab Matt. Oh, I don't think it should be that easy for you. He's made the tower invulnerable. So hang on, I'll find a workaround. Impressed by Miss Kensington. Though this attempt is as futile as the life of most humans. Oh, look, an alien with a superiority complex. Surprising. Though this sentiment comes from more than just the Zid, my dear. Tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow creeps in this petty pace from day to day. To the last syllable of recorded time. And all our yesterdays have lighted food. The way to dusty death. Oh, a brief candle. Life's but a walking shadow. A poor player that struts and frets his hour upon the stage. And then is heard no more. It is a tale told by an idiot. Full of sound and fury. Signifying Thanks for sharing your high school poetry. It's a quote from Macbeth. Yeah, I don't know. Prison. How am I gonna start a prison break without a gun? Chances are it's not a standard behind bars sort of prison. You'll just have to wing it. Wing it. Great. What can go wrong? Oh, and since I can't see what's going on in there, Dad will be able to help you either. Fuck me running. a choice. Walk through the blue door and continue to face yet more failures at saving those closest to you. Your race will live on borrowed time and will, through your violent arrogance, wind up extinct. Walk through the red door, however, and I will release the humans whom I have collected. I will give them amnesty and even a ship from my fleet to do with as they see fit. However, in choosing this door, you will willingly submit yourself to execution. This is the moment where you can prove to be the savior of humanity. 
or its absolute destroyer. What am I looking at? This is your life as it led you to this point. All your past violence, crimes and losses on display to remind you of one simple fact. Regardless of what I have done to your world, you were its greatest threat. The evidence is irrefutable. How many have died because you decided that driving on the sidewalk is faster than the road? Because you used a rocket in place of a bullet? Because you wouldn't submit to my rule? In the end, you only hurt those you are trying to protect. In the end, there is only one truth. The human race would be much safer without you in it. <sighs> Memories? It was total bullshit that you could only carry 200 pounds of bison meat. Wait, is that Matt? Trapped in technology he doesn't understand, in a cyber world he can't control. Matt, stay calm. I'll get you out. Without Miss Kensington. Very dumb. Empty space and a purple star. This is but a glimpse of what I have conquered. Ah, yes. I'm quite proud of this one. Why? What is it? Terror, as personified by your literary culture. A dead pirate with a black parrot? It's a raven. Why does the pirate have a raven? <sighs> Is this the island that pirate came from? Must you continue to display your plebeian intelligence? Yes. I tire of this. Deal with her on your own. Ta-ta. I can deal with anything you throw at me, buddy. Jesus Christ, Zenyak, are you 13? All right, pick up the phone and dial yourself out, Matt. don't like the idea of us sitting around. Shouldn't we be picking up Matt? The kid could be in trouble. Keith, you gotta relax. The guy's an MI6 agent, for God's sake. He can take care of himself. You needed help getting out, and you're the commander-in-chief. That's a really good point. Why didn't we think of this earlier? Oh, I did. I'm just not a big fan of Matt. Kinsey, come on! Can't I get some payback? Got a little lost, big deal. Or he got a little dead, who knows? Oh, he's fine. He's probably having the time of his life exploring Zinyak's ship.
You're really making a big deal out of nothing. This is a great opportunity for him to build character. Kinsey, this is not the time for a teachable moment. If we don't help Matt, he will die. Fine, take this. I was talking to the robot. It's power armor. Same thing. Not really. A robot is an automaton, whereas power Don't armor... ruin this case. Whoops. Are you breaking my power armor? No. If you do damage the power armor, you can find repair kits in some of the storage crates. Tell me more about the guns on this thing. Oh, um, I didn't have time to get them working, so... Pretty lame, Kinsey. I found you power armor. Because they're just missing stuff. Don't suppose you got a way to fit this robot through the door, do you? Ugh. Just asking. I know hacking's out, but there has to be another way through this door. Brute force works. This is gonna be fun. You take care of what's there, and I'll make sure they don't alert the others. to show this thing to Pierce. happened here. One of the pods is broken. Any chance that's the one Matt was in? Maybe. Hard to tell. Don't hurt me, please. I'm a friend. About time I was rescued. Oh, you wouldn't believe what they have. But I didn't realize they had robots. Can you believe Kinsey keeps calling this thing power armor? So, not a robot? What kind of firepower does that make have? Kinsey said the guns are missing stuff. <laughs> Typical. Give me a moment to find the parts.
Set you up. This will be much different than any other weapon you're used to. It's a gun arm, man. I think I can figure it out. It's more than just a gun. Be right there.
nothing in sight. Is this what being a sociopath feels like? It's not really sociopathic. Hey, remember that big ship you were asking about? sound needy or anything, but I just blew up a capital ship. You'd think someone could at least give me a high five. We need to take a look at this. A plane? Why would Zinyak want to build one of those? We're in deep space. It has to be another prison. Whose idea of hell is being trapped on an aeroplane? <sighs> me, Shandi, and... Oh my god. Johnny's alive. Boss, Johnny's dead. Who else would be stuck in a plane? Shandi? It was a life-defining moment for her. It's the only thing that makes sense. You're wrong. I think she's making a lot of sense. She's wrong! Find out where this is. We're getting my best friend back. I'm picking up major readings coming from your area. I think... Not one of those giant aliens are coming. So is in the exit about now.
difficult. Loading up another training program for you. Here, use this to test out that stomp thing. So I just slam the floor? Yep, and the blast wave will hurt them and throw them back. Let me guess, hidden clusters, right? Yep, Stomp should make the clusters pop up. Here. Try using it to take down a warden's shield. Good. Looks like it works. Sending you back now. Welcome to Super Power Fight Club! Wave one! Fight! Saints rule even here.
has been defeated!
Driving so
much for difficult. Yeah. <laughs>